I'm in a great mood. Uh, off to hockey, about to leave. Uh, so I figured, why not shoot this video now? Get it posted, you know, for my 10 views. Uh, no, but 5-3 win for, for the Toronto Maple Leafs over the Washington Capitals. I think they're now nine points up on Washington, Washington 65, Toronto 74. Somehow Toronto's still in third uh, in their division. Um, but I thought it was a, a good team game tonight. Uh, yeah, they gave up a 3-1 lead again, um, but they gave up a 3-1 lead because it was 3-1 after one. And I'm not gonna lie, all the goals Washington scored, I'm, I'm gonna give it to them. Maybe Mrazek wants that short and a goal back, but it was a nice shot. I think he was a bit worried about the two on one. It happens. Um, this game, so Mrazek's in net. I think he went 909 save percentage tonight, but uh, he made some key saves. Heck, he, he made a nice save with like two seconds left uh, in the game when the game was already over. Uh, but nonetheless, he made the save. Uh, Toronto starts out early. It's Michael Bunting, who now leads all rookies. Yes, 26-year-old um, Michael Bunting is a rookie, but remember Panarin was a rookie as well. So was Lundqvist at one point. Um, up there in age, yes, I think it's still more at Ciders. Uh, you know, trophy, Calder Trophy 2, lose. But Bunting's good. Uh, 19th goal of the year. I think he has, like, in 70-something games, maybe 80 games now, he has, like, 30 goals, uh, which is insane because Toronto has him, what, signed for another another year at, what, was it 825? 850? 925? It was under a million dollars. They have him signed for another, another year after this. Um, I called it at the beginning of the year. I said... Michael Bunting will be on a line with Mitch Marner and Austin Matthews, and he's going to do great, and he has. Uh, Mitch Marner picking the pocket of, I think it was Wilson, feed him Bunting, and him going high over Samsonov's shoulder, or Samsonov, I don't know how they, how they say it now. What a goal, two and a half minutes in or whatever. Leave score early. Uh, Nick Backstrom then uh, sends one on. Nice high shot. Connor Shearer with a great tip. Don't fault him there. Um, Good tip. It was going wide. <laughs> well deserved. Um, but that's okay. Uh, John Tavares did John Tavares things. He hasn't been getting many points. He's been working his butt off. Uh, this was a John Tavares game tonight. He played phenomenal. Uh, Pickpocketing everyone. Just the hard work. Grinding in the corners. Waiting um, waiting to find gaps to feed his teammates. And found uh, Willie Nylander there. He scores five hole. Makes it 2-1. No, he didn't leave the game to take a poo and then come back this one. Um, so he scores and that was great. And then Justin Hall, uh, who's, you know, that 10, seven game, he, he found some life, had a couple assists there. Uh, he scores, uh, with what was it like a second left, maybe less, uh, just drives the net says, ah, screw it. I'm going in Uh great work by Toronto to get that, uh, to the net. I think it was bunting made a move around Ovechkin, maybe around the sideboards. Matthews was there as well. Um, what a, what a goal. He fires it in there, makes it 3-1. Yes, the Capitals do come back, but they don't come back until the third period. It was 0-0 in the second. Good game throughout the second period. Austin Matthews saved the goal. Um, basically, was it on the goal line? Anyway, he, it, if he wasn't there to get rid of the buck, a Gabba player was going to put it in, and that could have changed the game. Again, showing offensively he's there, defensively he's there. I still say he's the best player in the league. Maybe they're not you know, the most talented or the best offensively. That's probably Connor McDavid. But I like what Adam Wilde said. He's better in the corners. He can score many, many ways. And he's defensively sound. And he wins a heck, a heck of a lot of draws. Um, anyway, uh, Washington do come back and they tie it up. Uh, Wilson, a nice tip on the power play. Great feed by Ovechkin. He had, he wired a few shots tonight. Mrazek came out big to make one save. There's a few wide, but he got a second chance here instead of shooting. It's the it's the pass through uh, through uh, through some sticks. Riley's not there to get uh, the stick lift on Wilson. Wilson was strong on a stick there. Great tip, high over the glove. Uh, if it didn't go to him, I think Shuri was there for the tip as well on the other side. Uh, to make it 3-2 and then a bad bounce on the power play gets by I forget who was there and Wilson again on the two on one Riley goes for the uh, for the the Brody dive Wilson shoots just over the pad under the glove it's a good shot yeah you might want to say like he'd like that one back but it's a it's good play shot and those are the ones that go in okay 3-3 three, three. Um, but that's okay that's okay because Justin Hall 
Uh, it's John Tavares again first. Let's rewind. John Tavares goes and pockets, I forget who, I think it was John Carlson behind the net. Fights for it. Feeds it between his legs uh, to Justin Hall, who's coming in. Filling in for William Nylander, who exits the zone. Sandine comes off the bench. You look like Hall is going to take a slap shot. He holds. Like, oh, is he going to wrist shot at Samsonov? Overplays. The defenseman overplays. Feeds it over to Sandine. Sandine scores. Yes, the, the defenseman dove out front, got a piece of it. It went in. John Tavares, you could just see him like, woohoo! 4 3. Justin Hall. This was a big game for Justin Hall. You know, he was in the press box. Last game was a 10 7 game, which is just a write off for everyone. Offensively, it was great. Defensively, no. He did okay. You know, he got in on, on the offense. Tonight was a big game for Justin Hall, and he did he did well. He did well. This is this is what we need to see from Justin Hall. Um, I'm very happy. I'm very happy. Um, what a pass. What a decision. Goal by Sandine. Uh, we play it out. You know, Capitals get a few chances. The Pause before we get to Angval's empty netter. Yes, sorry, Angval got an empty netter. Uh, great play at the point. But I think it might have been Kampf in there. I can remember correctly, getting it over to him. And then no one's catching Angwell on a straightaway, unless you're McKay or McDavid, because that giraffe can skate. So he scores. But before that, did anyone else notice that the Leafs were getting penalties that maybe weren't penalties? Like, Angwell got a trip on, I think it was Wilson, which was like, hmm, are you sure? Bunting got one as well. There's a few calls here tonight, and maybe, yeah, I'm a homer or whatever, but they were iffy. They were They were iffy. Uh, Capitals got the opportunity to, to you know, tie the game, to win the game on the power play, and they didn't do it. Leafs did well. Their penalty kill's good. We know the power play is good. Uh, and they sealed the deal. 5-3 win. Um, I'm happy. Much better defensively. Even though they gave up three goals, they were three good goals. Better defensively. They worked hard as a team. Michael Bunting scoring again. Um, Matthews is still Matthews. Marner is still magic. I think him and Matthews lead in points since, what, since the break. Uh, the winter break, uh, or Christmas break, whatever you want to say. Um, damn, this team's good. This team's good. Frustrating, but good, because you get a game like this, right? You know, they play that defensively sound game against the Wild. A hectic game against Detroit, which I said will always be. It's going to be. It's going to be chaos, which I love. It's shitty hockey out there. And then they beat Washington. Sound hockey, just like the, against Pittsburgh, you know what I mean? Uh I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm a happy Leafs fan. Let me know down below your thoughts on the game, how the Leafs are doing. Uh, and yeah, what, what do you think? What's going to happen at the deadline? Who's the Toronto going to go after? I still think they need a D. I don't think they go for a goaltender. Jack, uh, Sheldon Keefe said, you know, just, just mentally he's not there right now. He will get there. He will. I believe in Jack Campbell. Uh, he even said, you know, this is the first year being a starter. It's a lot of games. He's going to get there. And that's why Peter Mrazek is there as well just for the backup and he did well tonight let jack campbell play next game see what he's we'll see what he has anyway that's it for me comment down below your thoughts go leafs go